answer your question. We're just having some fun here. <laughs> love the love from Lubbock. Uh, welcome to Sports Center. That is John Anderson, and I am Linda Cohn. I'm still sort of working on where to hold the reception, but. <laughs> United, you know, United Spirit Arena wouldn't be a bad place. Think about it. Linda, it holds 15,000 people. All your friends could come and then yes. like two more. They had half a Lubbock in the place Monday night. Texas Tech hosting second rate. Kansas KU perfect in conference play. 10-0 Red Raiders, an impressive 7-3. and three. There's Bob Knight. Not always the success, though, against the Jayhawks. 5-10 and 10 all time. Third worst against any opponent. 0-4 oh, against the Beaker since taking over at Tech. Well, let's go right to Chase, huh? Less than three to go. Texas Tech up two. Let's make it five. Darius Jackson makes it 68-63. Kansas ball. Aaron Miles, he can answer from behind that arc as well. Kansas now down two. They trailed it six by six at half, 39-33. Ten to go now. Keith Langford is going to do it all by himself. Hard to the hole. He had 24 points. We are tied at 69. We are headed to overtime in Kansas. Uh, bet on him here. 7-0 in games decided by seven points or less. And we got a tight one here. Tight one. In overtime, Christian Moody at the line. Missed the first, second one. Devon Giles gets in there a little soon. Ball's not in Moody's hand, so he missed it. But whistle, we got a lane violation. Bob can't believe it. Moody's going to get another shot. That one, money. Strings, Knight not happy. Moody, after seeing the free throw, 71-70. Lankford then misses. Moody gets a rebound. Kansas down one at night on occasion. Doesn't get that happy. Same score. Daryl Dora on the line, Texas Tech. Fourth in the nation, free throw percentage. He misses. Knight's not pleased. Dora would make the second. Kansas down two. We're back on Evans. Wayne Simeon missed. Christian Moody one more time, tipping it in. 74 all. Let's play some more. 50 minutes would be fun. Kansas up two in the second. Overtime, Aaron Miles. Get it deep, kick it out. Lankford, Kansas up five. Thought they were on their way, but that would be their last score. Home team's not done. Jerry's Jackson tries the long three brick. Miles gets the rebound, but what's the whistle? Not a foul. Traveling. Look again. Three Red Raiders around him. We got steps. We got possession to the home team. Bobby Knight drawing something special up. Tick left and eight seconds to go. Ronald Ross inbounds over to Daryl Dora. 0 for 4 from 3 before that shot. Hey, if you're a freshman, you're too young to know any better. Steps up and just cranks it. Dora stoked. His team's up 80-79. Final seconds, Aaron Miles. He's going to have to go and then get lucky. No such thing. 80-79. You can hear the cheers in Lubbock. Tech, the fans storm the court. Coach Knight on the final few ticks. Got to guard him. Takes four seconds if a guy gets a ball on the move to get it down the floor from the baseline inbounds and to get at least a decent shot. And they had 3.6 seconds that they put back, put back up on the board. And so they were going to get it across midcourt and have a chance to, uh, to put it up there. But it really wasn't a shot. He, we had somebody with him, and, and it was in such a, such a way that uh, I'm just glad we didn't foul. <laughs> That's the motto for every coach, like, don't foul. <laughs> Long time coming for Coach Knight. General now just 31 wins behind all-time Division I leader Dean Smith. Door, as we mentioned, just one for five, but you only got to make one if it's the game winner. Red Raiders looking like a tournament team now, eight and three in the league, five and one at home, as they beat Kansas for the first time since February 13th of 99, and night six and ten all-time against KU.